What's going on YouTube? How are we doing guys? Listen, it's freaking raining out there. It's really hot. It's Florida, you know, the world, global warming, all this BS the world wants you to believe it's happening if you think it's happening. However, regardless of how it's looking out there, you can see here, you know, it's cloudy. It's sad. Nobody's out there. Nobody's walking. I'm on my way to the gym, guys. I'm on my way to the gym. I've been doing this for the last two months. Um, first month, I was just showing up at lunchtime. Hey, instead of sitting in my car to do nothing, let's, you know, let's go there. Instead of like wasting time at the restaurant or while, you know, enjoying my food, watching a stupid video, let's do something different. I've been doing this for a year now, meaning like a lunch, restaurant, you know, sit there, wait, chill. And those things like, listen, Christian, you have to be honest with yourself and understand that none of those things are gonna give you what you want in life at all nothing that's a whole hour you're wasting in a restaurant you know waiting for your food getting your food whatever so why did i do let me look around let me let me see what gym we have around hey we got a ufit no problem uh i have one by my house it's 20 minutes from here and truth be told man it's an ugliest gym there is fat people left and right it's like a bunch of high schoolers too so it's not good, man. I'll, I'll, I'll be honest, you know. Uh, I used to go to one in Boca, Deerfield Beach. You have different people, different type of energy, different type of vibe. People that really respect their bodies, people that really work out. It's like, damn, that's great. I don't want to see a, a fat lady or a fat dude or like, you know, it's like, it's not making me feel like, oh, damn, I want to strive for that. Like, no, it's like, damn. Like, I feel like, oh, if I keep hanging out with these guys, I, I'm going to be fat too, you know? Whatever. I found this gym. Uh, it's brand new, apparently, and it has a sauna. So I would do my 10 minutes in the treadmill, you know, running, sprinting, jogging, walking, whatever I had to do. I would do my cardio. Uh, sorry, I would do my weights. Today's chest day. Uh, I would do back another day, shoulders, arms, biceps, triceps, all those things, right? And, and not only that, Afterwards, I'll be like, hey, let me go on the, on, the, on the sauna for 15 minutes, 20 minutes, 10 minutes. Some days it's five minutes, some days I have to run. And, but you know, on an average, I like to keep it to 10, 15 minutes and really let everything out, really think, I sit there and think, hey, what am I doing? Where do I go? There's two moms here walking with babies, crossing the street, chilling, looking like a fat potato. I'm sorry, lady, but yeah, you look like a fat potato. <laughs> <laughs> and look it's been game changer guys now my girlfriend got a new war a new job she has to leave the house earlier i'm like listen i don't want to look like a loser when you leave early and i say it's living that's not the type of person i'm gonna be because i used to wake up later like at nine let's get out of the house at seven and it gets me a whole hour here in the mornings hour and some change to do my cardio to do more sauna so i do like a whole hour of cardio you know walking moving 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 i get nothing done on the couch but i know i can do something i can get something done here while i'm walking I'm, i just pulled up to the gym as you can see here and listen guys that changed everything it's waking me up it's changing my lifestyle it's changing the way i eat the way i carry myself I saw this very controversial man that I respect a lot, Tristan Tate, you know, the famous Tate brothers. They asked him, hey, what's the best brand, clothing brand you can recommend somebody? He's like, being fit. If you look good, you look good in any clothing, in any clothes, in any shirt, in any long sleeve. If you look good, you look good on anything. And that shit so hit me so hard. I'm like, bitch, I'm fat. I'm ugly. I need to get, like this shirt's from Walmart. You know, I'm not. I'm not telling you. Oh yeah, I have some Hugo Boss and Hugo Boss, whatever you want to call it. And all this stupid shit. But listen, guys, it, it, it's about like you gotta be good. You gotta feel good. You gotta get your shit in. You gotta get your workouts in. You know, all this. And you're just gonna park here because I couldn't find parking close by. But the, the thing is, the truth of the matter is, is get moving get moving get moving think different and i've been soaking in this content from yadas fitness uh, it's l l a d o s fitness it's hispanic spanish mostly and then you have wes watson uh wes my guy he tells you hey 
Become the man you admire and give it to the world. And that's what I'm doing right now. I wanna give myself to you guys to help you. Those are stranded, hey, I nine to five, I hate a nine to five, I hate a nine to five. But guess what, I have to pay the bills. So how can I help the people feel different? Once you feel different, you look different, you start thinking different, your results start being different. Your actions are completely different. You know, I could be chilling now, going to Chipotle, you know, chilling, taking a nap, whatnot. I'm here. You fit gyms right there. So get moving. Get moving. I, I'm I'm absorbing all this. All I watch now it's Wes Watson and Yados is like, listen, do this, think different. Like I, I used to vibe so high in life before. Don't know what happened. And I'm like, dude, I was driving Ferraris down in Manchester in California. Now I'm here like a regular dude. Like, this is not the life that I want. This is not the life I want for my lady. This is not the wife, the, the, the wife. Uh, this is not the life I want for my kids. I'm meant to do so much more. Not only this, you know, it's not that I'm unsatisfied. No, I know my potential, not how much I can do. And if I do more, I can reach more people. I already changed people's lives. Hundreds of students through e-commerce, through Amazon FBA. And it's crazy. I don't even know the title of this video. All I'm saying is, hey, I felt good. I've been watching these guys' videos, Yados and Wes Watson. and I've been watching their students. The, the way they think, the way they carry themselves, the way they talk is like, you're right. You have to surround yourself with people that vibrate in higher frequencies. So you vibe on a higher frequency too. If you sit in, which is my case, one of my coworkers, oh my God, the world's gonna fall apart. Fuck Trump. I'm like, fuck Joe Biden, bitch. But like we get into all this whole politics thing, you know? Oh my God, the Super Bowl, uh, the Super Mega Bowl, whatever the, 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 the lottery thing is, the Power Bowl winner. I'm like, oh, a billion dollars. I wish I could get like, listen, you know, 70% of them go bankrupt within a few years. Money doesn't change your shit. It's your mindset, it's your habits, it's what you do, it's what you don't do. I'm working on it myself with my money. I'm like, okay, how can I do better? My fucking cards going up. How can I get them down? What are we gonna do? You know, do I have to make more money? How can I make more money? I'm buying this inventory from Amazon. I'm shipping it to Amazon. I'm flipping them gear. Boom, boom, boom. All these things. But the point is, you become who you surround yourself with. You become who you surround yourself with. So I don't want to be like the people around myself. None of them. Not one person in real life in front of me. But I'll tell you what I want to be like. I want to be like Wes Watson. I want to be like Yadis Fitness. I want to be like those motherfuckers. I find I saw somebody moving their car. Hopefully I can catch the parking because, you know, come on. Let's see. Winner, winner, chicken dinner, maybe. Don't listen to the seatbelt. Oh, yeah, bitch. Yeah, winner, winner, chicken dinner, baby. Look, I'm parking right here, guys. Right in front of this bitch. I'm going to close the door, my guy. Thank you so much. I need to park. There we go. You see? Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Start looking for what you want in life. Stop settling for a stupid, ugly parking spot. Get the best one. Talk to you guys later. Peace.